I'm an artist based in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. Primarily my practice revolves around sculptural processes. A lot of them involve engaging with specific contexts and sites, locations, places. A lot of times that take shape as a physical object, sometimes that takes shape as an image involving a photographic process or digital process. My current work is responding to this invitation where the public art program in the city of Calgary invited myself and several artists to become embedded or work with the Utilities and Environmental Protection Department within the city. That department is involved with the management of water resources, infrastructure, and everything related to the watershed that supports this large city in, in the plains of Alberta. Through that, I was able to work with anyone from a soil scientist, sediment transport, and trying to understand how this river system transports soils and debris throughout it, affecting everything from biology to water quality. My interest sort of evolved out of this huge sort of shift in perspective. I remember visiting this glacier um, outside of the city, sort of imagining its scale, imagining it traversing the continent, then situating myself within this like tiny room within this wastewater plant and encountering this technician who was uh, introducing me to this machine that they used. The technician was sort of describing its function and uh, made mention that as it was sampling these, this collection of water, it was being fed into this machine that could heat up to the temperatures found on the surface of the sun. And through that, they could perceive the, the watershed in this sort of astonishing level of resolution. and. They could detect various elements at parts per trillion levels of concentration. I became very fascinated with this sort of shift in scale. And the work I've been developing here at the Bemis Center, parts per trillion, sort of resulted in this attempt to recreate all this collection of objects. Most of them have been these rocks that I've encountered at this specific site along the Bow River in Calgary. It opens up into this washout where there's just thousands and thousands of these river rocks. And so these rocks get shifted around and moved by the river, but they also get moved by the people that sort of come upon the space. And so all these rocks are sort of being used to create these kind of public sculptures that sort of grow and get destroyed and get moved around. And there's this one moment in this space where there's this huge pile of these rocks and all of the rocks are inscribed with graffiti and spray painted and scratched onto. Over the sort of months and years that I've spent revisiting this site, I've seen how it's sort of shifted and evolved as this sort of co-relationship with these people and the river. At least while I'm, I've been at the Bemis Center, I've been exploring how to kind of stage this work, how to place these objects in a space and evolve it into some format that responds to this original context that a lot of these objects came from.